All right, I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to make a car like this in Magic of Voxel. I mean, you could do it a lot of ways, but this is the way I did it. So first I'm going to say new. All right, I said I'm going to say new. There we go. And then I'm going to clear that box out. And by default, I have 40, 40, 40 as my world's voxel space size. I'm going to change it to 100, 100, 100. Now I could just have more detail in my car. I could have more voxels for it. And then I'm going, to I'm going to take this and go on the side view here, and I'm going to draw the profile of the car. Let me turn off the mirror and use Attach and Line. And I pick a color for my car. I'm going to pick Hot Red. So for my side view, I'm just going to start outlining um, a profile here. So there we go. The hood, a little bit of the angle. And then the windshield and the back of the car. Yeah, something like that. And maybe a little airfoil like that. And then let's come back down. And now I'm going to start doing the bottom of the car. It's going to have a shape like this. And it kind of closed that loop. All right, so am I happy that it doesn't look like a boat? Okay, good. So then I'm going to use the face, the fill command, and I'm going to fill in that space. And then I'll just hold it to give my car some width. Let's see how that, a little bit wider. Okay, and then after that, I could, well, I got these little measurements here. Let me make it an even. All right. Just kind of even out. You see I have the grid lines to say the spacing and just take off one. Ah, there. That way I have an even number. And now I could use my the loop functionality to move it into center. Oh, that's moving it down. That's moving it back and forth. And X is to move it over here. All right, and I could use the grid lines to make sure when I get to the center. There we go. I have the center. All right, um, now that I have this basic shape of my car, I am going to add a little bit more of a kind of like, instead of it being like a block on the side, coming out a little bit on the side. And the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to use the line tool again and I'm just going to outline something on the side here. Okay, I'll just have it stretch out to the side. Okay, and then the fill again. Boom. So I think I did forget something though. I just did that outline and it didn't come out on the other side. So let me undo and undo all those lines. And I want to turn on mirror for the X. Is it mirror for the X? Let's, see. yes, it is. Okay, mirror for the X. So what I do on one side happens on the other side now. So now I'm going to do the line tool again. Do a little outline here. Shape my car. Again. Come around. And boom. Now that should happen on both sides. Good. And then go to the face and have it come out once, maybe twice, three times. Yeah, giving the car a little bit more shape. And then one more outline in the middle here. Come around. I'm just doing the line tool over here, just doing the line tool. And come up and then face to fill that in one time. There, that way so it doesn't look so blocky, you know? All right, now I could clean up some of these edges here. Like right here, I have this extra stuff. So I'm gonna go to B, erase, just erase these blocks that I have happening on one side. 
and one more. Boop. And this one too. Boop. And you too. Boop. Okay, just doing some finer touches. And then over here, these guys are sticking out. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Um, one of the other main things about a car, the wheels. So for the wheels, I'm going to go to the V tool and go to Sphere 2D. And let's see. Let's make the... Let's make the outline in the car body for the wheels. I'll say, well, how big we want these wheels, guys? 18. Let's see how big 18 is. And let's give it a color of a tire. And it's going to be an attach. Nah, that's too big. That's too big, guys. Let's do um, 15. That's better. That's better. And the wheels don't have to be like way down at the bottom. So let's see. Got a wheel here. I'm gonna put in the back wheels. The back wheels, maybe they could be bigger. Kind of like more like a dragster. 18. And that's cool. Double tap that. All right, so I got two wheels, but they're really kind of skinny. So, oh man. Now I should have stayed, make these guys fatter. Oh, I just use face, that's right. Give the wheel some more thickness here. Mm -hmm. Front and back wheels. All right, and then we could have the hubcaps of the wheels. What color do we want this car's hubcaps to be? Oh, let's just make them silver okay so it could be silver like this or maybe some other fancy color yeah just pick silver right there and i'm gonna do paint uh no let's do v um let's make the hubcaps the same size let's say let's start off with seeing what 12 looks like and is that good it's kind of big huh but I think that's good. So we put that there. And this one, maybe I'll make it a little bit smaller. 10. And the front wheel. 10. There. Okay. Now we got wheels. We got that. And let's put some headlights on this guy. So the headlights, I'll make them white. And I'll say the size of them is maybe... Six big headlights? Nah. Let's make it five. Five. Two little blinker lights like that. Okay. Maybe six. Just using my using my feelings here. Six. Two little blinker lights like that. And oh, talk about the turn signals. Let's do those and let's make those cube. And just be little small turn signals. Maybe a little bigger. Enter. Okay, and I'll have them here. Oh, you know what? Turn signal should be on the side, visible from the side too. So instead of just flat, I'll make it 3D. Ooh. All right, maybe flat. And I'll go like that. And then I'll go on the side here like this there now i got the blinkers going around the corner and then on the back i gotta have some blinkers too there and there oh now we're gonna do we're gonna have red um lights for the back so pick this red and just to be a different red you can't really tell can you how about this red all right that's better something you could tell a little bit different and should we make our backlights red and a sphere shape? I think so. And we'll put them right there. And inside that, we'll put a brighter red and a little bit smaller. And press enter. There we go. Nah, that don't look good. Okay, bing, bang, boom. Now we need uh, the bumper. 
which I'll make the bumper a gray, maybe a lighter gray, like this one, like the hubcap gray. Bam. Okay, and let's use the cube shape again, and maybe a little bit bigger, five. Okay, so bumper. Uh, oopsie. How about that? That's the back bumper and a front bumper. There we go. Looking like something now. Now for the windows, let's check that out. Let's make the windows a different color like I did in mine. And what I'm going to do is just use the paint. And I'm going to get a little closer here and I'm going to start painting. That, uh, this is the window area up here. Just going to paint all these pixels white. Okay. And then from the front, same thing, paint all these pixels white. Uh huh. And the back window. Good. Very good. All right. And on the top, now to outline the car, I'm gonna go back to my red. So let me just do Alt, press the button to get the red again. And I'm just gonna attach some lines here. Ooh, painting lines. Uh, escape. Let's do the let's do the drawer the lines. Let's do some actual lines and pixels on the top and on the side. Okay, and then over here on the roof. Let's give it some lineage. And then coming down the side here. One. And on that top part, two. Oh, why doesn't it look nice here? Two. Well, you know, gotta clean it up a little. Three. And from the side view, three. Oh, it's looking rough. Well, here, four. 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 What am I doing? Oh, I know what I could do. I could do like a visor. <laughs> okay, so. Okay, look at that side view. And there, we kind of made a hot little red car. Yeah, baby. There you go.